Prepare for liftoff as we embark on an exhilarating journey through the cosmos. In this video, a brilliant NASA mind unveils a cutting-edge light-speed engine that could make visiting Proxima be a reality. Get an exclusive sneak peek into the technology that has the potential to revolutionize space travel as we know it. Don't miss this chance to explore a world of interstellar possibilities and witness the breathtaking innovations that bring us closer to the stars. Are you ready to be part of the generation that conquers the final frontier? Hit play and let's soar. The invention of the light speed engine, which is about to revolutionize space travel as we know it. If you've ever dreamed of visiting distant stars, now's the time to buckle up and get ready for the ride of your life. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel, and hit that notification bell to stay updated with the latest in space exploration. All right, let's dive into this fascinating journey to Proxima B. Imagine reaching out to touch the stars in the night sky. They may seem tiny, but these shining objects are actually gigantic, appearing small because they are trillions of miles away. Human advancements in space travel have taken us farther than our ancestors ever dreamed possible, but current rocket technology still can't take us to the distant stars we see at night. Many of these stars have planets orbiting them, known as exoplanets. An exoplanet, short for extrasolar planet, is a planet that orbits a star outside our solar system. With an estimated 200 sextillion stars in the universe that's a 2 followed by 23 zeros, there could be trillions of exoplanets out there. One of these fascinating worlds is Proxima b, the closest exoplanet to us. Proxima b orbits its star every 11.2 Earth days and is estimated to have a minimum mass of 1.2 Earth masses. Located just 0.0485 astronomical units from its star, it's about 20 times closer to its star than Earth is to the Sun. Part of a triple star system, Proxima b orbits Proxima Centauri, a variable star known for causing flares and abrupt brightness changes. This means that any atmosphere Proxima b has could be destroyed by the star's UV and X-ray emissions. Despite its distance, Proxima b is interesting because it's located in the habitable zone of its planetary system, making it similar to Earth in many ways. This has caught the attention of astronomers, who are eager to learn more about this mysterious exoplanet. However, many questions about Proxima b remain unanswered, such as whether it has atmosphere or moons. Proxima b is situated 4.2 light years away from our solar system and is part of the Alpha Centauri triple star system. Its close proximity, Earth-like size, and location in the habitable zone make Proxima b a tantalizing subject for researchers. But the ultimate question on everyone's mind is, could life exist on Proxima b? Scientists have spent decades trying to determine whether life could exist outside our solar system, and Proxima b seems like a good candidate. To explore the possibility of life on this exoplanet, researchers have used sophisticated 3DD models to study the potential presence of liquid water and an atmosphere. They found that liquid water may exist only in the sunniest regions of the planet, either in the hemisphere facing the star or in a tropical belt. Sending a probe to Proxima b would be the ideal way to explore its potential for life, but the vast distance pose is a significant challenge. With current technology, a journey to Proxima Centauri would take thousands of years, requiring multiple generations of travelers to complete the journey. Using the speeds achieved by past missions like Apollo 11, New Horizons, and Juno, it would take anywhere from 17,157 to over 100,000 years to reach Proxima Centauri. So, what are our options for propelling a probe toward Proxima b using today's technology? Scientists and engineers are continuously working on advanced propulsion technologies to make interstellar travel a reality. Ideas like solar sails, nuclear propulsion, and ion drives are being explored to develop faster and more efficient space travel methods. These advanced systems could potentially shorten the travel time to Proxima b significantly, 
opening up new possibilities for exploring this mysterious exoplanet. Today, various technologies are being developed to launch spacecraft in the direction of Proxima b. One of these is ion propulsion, which has been used to propel unmanned space probes faster across the universe. The most recent spacecraft using ion propulsion systems are solar-powered and rely on a small amount of xenon or another propellant for the journey. Due to its fuel efficiency, ion propulsion is a practical and cost-effective method for traveling to nearby stars. In 1998, Deep Space 1 DS-1 became the first spacecraft to use ion drive technology, achieving a velocity of 35,000 miles per hour, 56,000 kilometers per hour. At that rate, it would take 81,000 years to reach Proxima Centauri. Gravity Assist is another method for propelling spacecraft at high speeds. In 1974, Mariner 10 used the gravitational field of Venus to propel itself toward Mercury, and in 1976, the NASA Helios probe reached a maximum velocity of over 150,000 miles per hour, 240,000 kilometers per hour using the sun's gravitational pull. However, even at this rate, it would take between 19,000 and 76,000 years to reach Proxima Centauri, depending on the spacecraft's velocity. Nuclear Thermal Propulsion NTP and Nuclear Electric Propulsion NEP are other potential options. These technologies, which have not been used in a spacecraft yet, involve using uranium or deuterium-based reactions to propel the spacecraft via nuclear fission or fusion rather than chemical propellants. If perfected, NTP and NEP could reduce travel time to Proxima Centauri to around 1,000 years. Breakthrough Starshot is a project aiming to develop a spacecraft that can reach the stars within a human lifetime. This would involve creating a small, robotic starship-equipped nanocraft and propelling it with a powerful push, such as using laser light sails. This method could potentially send the spacecraft to Proxima Centauri at speeds over 130 million miles per hour, 216 million kilometers per hour. While these technologies are still being developed and perfected, they represent promising steps towards enabling interstellar travel and exploration of distant stars like Proxima Centauri. The concept of using light sails for propulsion is not new. It dates back to a 1610 letter from astronomer Johannes Kepler to Galilea Galilei. In 1924, Soviet rocket pioneers Friedrich Sander and Konstantin Tsiolkovsky further explored the potential of sunlight to sail through space. Hungarian astrophysicist George Marx and American physicist and science fiction writer Robert Forward also contributed to the development of the light sail concept. In the 1980s and 1990s, researchers at NASA Glenn Research Center, such as Jeffrey Landis, expanded on Forward's basic design for an ultralight interstellar probe powered by microwave lasers. However, these projects never became a reality. It wasn't until the 21st century that progress in light sail technology began to accelerate. In 2005, the Planetary Society launched Cosmos 1, a solar sail, but it failed to reach orbit. In 2010, the Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency JAXA successfully launched the Interplanetary Kite Craft accelerated by radiation of the Sun IKAROS, which rallied on sunlight to accelerate and adjust its orientation. As we continue to develop and refine these propulsion technologies, including ion propulsion, gravity assist, nuclear propulsion, and light sails, the possibility of interstellar travel becomes more feasible. Projects like Breakthrough Starshot offer hope for reaching distant stars like Proxima Centauri within a human lifetime, enabling us to explore the universe and potentially discover new worlds. While we still have a long way to go before achieving practical interstellar travel, the ongoing research and technological advancements bring us closer to that goal. As we continue to develop these innovative propulsion methods, we may one day unlock the secrets of the universe and gain a deeper understanding of our place within it. 
And that's it for today's journey into the world of exoplanets and the captivating Proxima b. As our understanding of the universe expands, so does our curiosity to explore these distant worlds. But one thing's for sure our passion for space exploration is limitless.